What's up, guys? Blue Mining here. Uh, market's green. Oh, well. <laughs> Probably be ready again tomorrow. We already know how it works. Uh -huh. Ethereum Classic. No blocks. 5% luck. Uh, not likely to be hitting a block anytime soon as low, so I'll keep an eye on it. I'll keep you guys updated. Don't mind this. <laughs> um, looks like nice hash for ET hash is 215 a day, Ethereum 202 a day. Raven coin at the top. Look at those prices. Now, another thing, I went to nerdgears.com today, and to my surprise, look at that price for a 3060 Ti Founders Edition under MSRP. Like, I'm, I'm tempted. I don't have the money for it right now, but if I have a little extra cash after my paycheck, I may or may not try and get one if it's not sold out. You know, this video is going to come out, and if anyone actually watches this video, they're going to be like, ooh, bye. Doesn't matter if you're a gamer or a crypto miner, there's always gonna be someone that sees that and just says, ooh, I want it. Because graphics cards are not just for people who mine, they're also for people that play video games and stuff. A lot of, like, the 3060 Ti is great for gaming. I know, I've played video games on it. I love it. I have my Minecraft settings cranked. I have my Call of Duty settings cranked, my Battlefield settings cranked, and I'm still playing the game just fine. I'm still getting plenty of FPS. <clears throat> As I was saying though, the market, it's looking alright. Um, it'll probably be red again tomorrow. It goes up, it goes down, it, it goes all around. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, other than solo mining, uh, it looks like the profitability has gone up a little bit for the app miner L3 Plus. Doesn't mean I'm going to plug it in. I got a cord on the way, yes, but that doesn't mean I'm going to plug it in when it gets here. Because, well, I don't really think that's worth it. <laughs> I don't want to lose 68 cents a day because you know it's already expensive enough. It's 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 summertime. You know I'm paying for an air conditioning. Air conditioning uses a lot of electricity. You know, the prices go up. I watch, you know, in the winter time, my electric bill is so small. And in the summertime, my electric bill just spikes. Like, this is my first summer I've mined crypto. And just for like the spring, when I started, like halfway through spring, I started up my AC and the price like skyrocketed. And now I have a bigger apartment, and I have a little plug-in uh, AC in my room. The ones that, you know, you can stick the little vent the little vent out into the outside through window, and you just have this nice cool blowing in. <clears throat> I have one of those plugged in. Both these ACs are just keeping this place cool, but <laughs> trust me, if I see my electric bill like almost $300 or well over $200 I'm probably going to unplug that AC and just slap a couple fans in my room because that is going to be way too much <laughs> I don't want to pay you know, a quarter of my paycheck on uh, electrical and no I'm not going to take my coins out and sell them to pay for electric why would I do that I want to hodl my coins and I want to get as many of those as I can so yeah, one of those comes to show. I do want to get this. Ant, I want to get the ant miner running eventually. I'm just waiting until, like, I I don't mind if it's negative, if it's like negative twenty cents. Is that gonna happen anytime soon? Probably not. You can see, Litecoin's right there, fifty-five dollars. <coughs> it was probably profitable and. It was up here, 60 some dollars. I don't know the all time high actually. Oh, 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 oh over $200, okay. I don't know if that's the all time. No, it was over $300 was the all time, but I don't know. 
All I know is that once it becomes profitable, once it, it, it will eventually become profitable. Let's be honest. Like, if the, if the market goes up and then goes down and goes up and goes down, it's not going to be the most profitable. It'll probably be like a mini. Like a, a mini Litecoin miner or something. The only reason those are profitable is because they only use like 200 watts. And they only have like 200 mega hash. This uses 800 watts, 504 mega hash. Of course, there is a in Hive OS they do have a firmware where you can make it go 1300 watts to like 700 mega hash, but that's still the wattage outweighs the hash rate. <laughs> now, if I can make it go 800 watts at 700 mega hash, now maybe it'll be a little worth it. <laughs> but yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> that probably break the damn thing but I want to eventually get it up and running I don't want to just have it shut off I don't want to have it as like a display I just wanted an ASIC miner I thought it was cool wasn't really an investment on my part I just thought it was cool always wanted an ASIC miner I'm not a big you know crypto youtuber that's gonna have like all these companies sending me sending me their products to check out and test like hell I wish I could <laughs> but the the likelihood of me becoming a big YouTuber for crypto is very low. Do I want to be a big crypto YouTuber? I want to mind it. It would be a lot of work, though. Because then you have to make uploads. You have to let people know what's going on a lot more. You know, staying small is nice. But the more my farm grows and the more I upload, the more popular I can get. And I'm fine. I'm fine if I had thousands of viewers I'm fine if I had people watching my videos I'd be fine with that <coughs> <coughs> but behind the scenes raising a kid working a full-time job it's kind of hard to it's kind of hard to balance that out can I work 12-hour shifts in the shop four days a week I'm very tired when I get home <laughs> Like, yeah, I could come home, upload a video, and then go to bed. I could. But there's no motivation for that yet. Like, hell, if I had a 1,000-plus subscribers, probably. I'd probably upload a video, just update. Like, hey, you know, solo mining this, blah, 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 blah. But, hell, by the time of that, we might be in our next bull run. You never know, though. There's, a lot of, there's not many crypto YouTubers out there. No, not many people putting their putting themselves out there showing off how crypto is going for them, and there's reasons for it. People like to keep privacy. You no, know, crypto is not something that everyone wants to like shout out to the world. They do. Some of them still hide their faces. You know, I don't think Red Panda Mining's ever shown his face. I don't think he ever will. But damn, I like watching his videos. You know, he's a, he's a fun guy to watch and I'm pretty sure if anyone watches my videos they know damn well who it is and I like the guy you know me personally <clears throat> I watch the hobbyist miner I watch red panda mining boss coin Brandon coin I watch all those guys and they're kind of the motivation or they're kind of like I wouldn't say motivation but like the inspiration to start my own crypto YouTube channel, just you know, talk about it. It's fun to talk about. My girlfriend gets sick and tired of me talking to her about crypto all the time. <laughs> so, being able to like just go on YouTube, I don't have to show my face. I don't have to really do any of that. I can just talk into my microphone. You know, y'all guys will see my face eventually. There's nothing for me to hide. I've had so many YouTube channels before, and they kind of just didn't kick off and YouTube isn't my dream I just make YouTube channels and they kind of die off and I get bored of them I ain't gonna get bored of this one though I actually enjoy uploading videos talking about crypto like hell solo mining fun I like it solo mining's fun it's it's a, it's a lot of risk but it's really fun <coughs> the risk outweighs the reward but still I find it rewarding mentally <laughs> but yeah 
Uh, it's just a short little video, just updating you guys. I still don't feel very good if you couldn't tell. Um, I'm hoping to feel good soon. I'll keep you guys updated on how solar mining's going. I'll keep you updated on how profitability on this is going, how the market's looking. I'll keep you updated on all of it. I'll, graphics cards update, of course. I always want to keep you guys knowing what the graphics card prices are like. Because you never know. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.